Disobedience, directed by Sebastian Lilo, starring Rachel Weisz and Rachel McAdams. This movie is about a Jewish photographer named Renette Kruska, played by Rachel Weisz, who learns that her father, who is a rabbi, died, and she comes back to her hometown to reconcile with her father's death. She learns that her father is dead from her friend Esty Cooperman, who is a Jewish teacher in the area. So she comes back to her hometown and stays with Esty and her husband, David. And David is next in line to be the new rabbi. And we find out that Esty and Ronette used to be lesbian lovers and they decide to get back together even though Esty is married to David. She still has feelings for Ronette. So they are having an affair behind David's back and so we got these two lesbians who are trying to be together in a very conservative Jewish area and this movie is really good I really like the chemistry between Rachel McAdams and Rachel Weiss Rachel and Rachel <laughs> these two are really good together and I did like the guy that plays Rachel McAdams' husband in the movie, and the friction between these two was done very well. The whole drama in the movie was very good, but the only thing I didn't like was the ending. I was expecting this movie to end a bit differently, and the movie doesn't end that way. There is a bit of a complication that happens within the movie, which I did not want to spoil. And I didn't think like this complication was really much of a problem to change the ending that much. But overall, I did like this movie and I definitely think people should check this movie out because Rachel Weisz and Rachel McAdams are great in the movie, even though I know that the Han Solo movie will, will be the movie that most people will want to see or if they don't want to see that, they probably may still want to see either Deadpool 2 or Avengers Infinity War. But I definitely think people should check out Disobedience. So I'm going to give this movie a A-. And that's all I got to say for Disobedience. It's really a good movie.